Seeing that old mill spinning again really makes it feel like home sweet home. Hmm. <laughs> I hear that. It really is one of the most beautiful things about this town. Well, citizens, our enemy can't be far behind. I thank you for your help. Goodbye, and take care. <laughs> How's the packing coming along, Ys? Almost done. I only need to take the everyday basics. Well, the Empire's got to be close by. Let's hit the road by sundown. Martha, look! Wilkes is here! Oh! <laughs> Welcome back, Welkies! <laughs> You're still calling me that? Martha, I'm 22 years old. And more important, you shouldn't be running around. Aren't you due any day now? Ah, oh, a light jog won't hurt the little spud. <laughs> I should know. I've already had four of them. <laughs> Hello there. Um, is Welkin in? Oh, hello, Alicia. What brings you here? I just wanted to apologize. For before. Um, here. This is for you. Really? These are for me? I work at the bakery. Well, I did until the war started anyway. It's where I live, too. That's preserved bread, so it's pretty hard. Heat it up before you eat it, all right? I baked it myself, so the flavor's guaranteed. Best you ever had. Thanks. Uh, do you want to come in? Arrested and shot at? <laughs> You've had a busy day of it, haven't you, Welkies? And what a lovely lady you are for all that adventuring. Good job, Welkies. What? Wait, no, it's not like that. Alicia just saved my skin, that's all. He's right, we just met. I'm not his girlfriend, just his hero. Although I'm really hoping to be his friend. Oh, well I'm sure you will. Be good to my Welkies here, won't you? Okay, seriously, Martha, enough with the Welk... That's a lovely portrait. Is that General Gunther? Yep. It was taken before I was born. But that's Dad. That's Dad? You're a lucky guy. And who's that with him, there? My father, Tamer. He was an engineer. The General's tank was his creation. Wait a minute. But I thought the General was your dad. My birth parents died when I was a baby. The General was kind enough to take me in as his own after that. Yeah. We're not related by blood, but she's definitely my little sister. Sorry, was that question too personal? No, I don't mind at all. I was blessed with two wonderful fathers. Yeah, I guess you were, huh? Oh, is that really the time? I've got to get going. Why don't you see her off, Welks? I can take care of the rest of this on my own. All right, I will. I'll be right back. See you later, Isara. Safe travels.
Okay. Gotta admit, I don't mind watching those. They're kind of fun. However, I am anxious to get back into turn basing. Wow, look at this. Brule's really becoming a ghost town. They've been leaving for a while. Just about everyone is evacuated by now. You can't blame them. Tensions are rising with the Empire. We'll survive. The Town Watch will guard and protect the home front. Everyone will come back someday. They'll come back when it's safe again, right? Mm -hmm. So, Welkin, I'm curious. Are you gonna join the army like your father? Hmm. I don't think that's for me. What I'd really like to do is be a teacher. Huh. A teacher? Yeah. Animals and insects, flowers and plants, they've always been my passion. I've learned a lot from nature. You see, my dad, he protected this country as a general, but it's just that I, I want to give back in my own way. My own way, you know what I mean? I think I do. You're sure about it? Mm -hmm. Wow, that's deep in your own way. Believe it. The mill. Miss Melchior, the Imperials are attacking. There's a squad of them in town right now. Get all the town watch together now. We've got to fend them off. They must be at Mill Plaza. I'll help. Thanks, Welkin. Now move out. Stay low. Okay, this one says 3A, so hopefully, uh, since it's starting over, we get a combat scene. I'll explain the mission. The enemy's invaded the windmill plaza and has taken almost the entire area over. We'll deploy from this position. No point for me. Okay. Hide behind the sandbags for cover as you advance towards the plaza. Our goal this time is to eliminate the enemy leader. I'm pretty sure they'll be in the plaza area. Be careful, there may be enemy units hiding behind the buildings out there. Hidden enemies won't show up in the command mode view, so be careful as you make your advance. And... Just like normal. Okay, let's begin. It's up to us to defend Brule. If she dies, or if Welkins dies, or if we take 20 turns, which it looks like is quite a bit. Okay, so how many actions do I get? Our target is the Imperials in Mill Plaza. Focus on taking down their captain. Breaking the chain of command should at least buy some time for the townspeople to get away. All right, I got it. Let's all be careful out there. Got a second? Listen close and I'll explain. Damage. Set amount of damage. Unit has sustained is healed each turn. That's cool. If unit has taken heavy damage, don't push them, stay back and heal up. Should enemy attacks drive a unit's hit points to zero, their condition becomes critical. This 
battle, you have no way of helping a unit in critical condition. Try to fight carefully so no one's hit points re reach zero. Okay, I've got three CP. And I'm going to do the same thing I did before. Where's my town watchman? He's going to... Oops. Sight lines. When a unit sights an enemy player in action mode, a sight line will peel over his head. Okay, that I've been saying, yeah. Use as a guide when attacking or in trying to position your units in a spot where they'll be safe from enemy attacks. So he'll crouch, he'll hit E. Attacking enemies, Q or E buttons while in target mode will automatically lock on to the next enemy within firing range. Crosshairs will turn red when a unit aiming at an enemy has a clear line of sight to their target. Use the guideline that extends from the gun when firing near obstacles to see if they are blocking the shot. If that line is interrupted, it means the unit's attacks will be blocked. When the crosshairs are on an enemy, the attacking unit's weapon specifications appear at the top of the screen. VS PERS shows damage against human targets versus armor shows damage against tanks and armor. Symbol will indicate the effectiveness against a different type of target. Indicate a zero will indicate the weapon is effective against that type. Triangle indicates the weapon can only give slight damage, and X means the weapon is ineffective against that type of target. Area shows whether the attacks will damage a broad area, and shots shows the number of rounds fired per each attack. Two kills, number of shots that need to connect in order to defeat the target. In this case, of the five rounds fired, two must hit to defeat this enemy unit. This number only takes shots that hit the center of the crosshair into account. Misses or hits in other area of the target are not taken into account in this number. This provides an estimate you can use when selecting a target and can be used to line up headshots and critical attacks. That said, do that. Let's click. And then I'll end his turn. I think. End the current action. You can reload, whatever. And then Alicia. My turn, okay? What's gonna happen when she goes up here? Got him. She'll end her turn. And give me Welkins. Here we go. Or Welkin. I guess I've been putting an E on the end of that. Enemy sighted. E there. Oh, there's a guy behind him. Oh, wait, wait. I gotta end it. Phase because I'm done. Oh wow, he had five CP. Heh, got him. He got shot just when we reacted to him. Now he's just barely alive. corner. Interesting. Didn't look like he used all his CP. Um, no, we're going to go for the Watchman again. Oops, I didn't do that right.
Alicia. Moving out. I don't know where I want her to go. Other than forward. Fine. She's down in cover. And then this here, here we go is Vulcan. There's the dude. And let's see if I can get this guy in one shot. Nope. I was trying to do it in two turns. There's even more this time. He didn't hit at all. That's nice. Looks like I got a headshot or something. I don't know what that means. Sounds like a tank. 